Now it's time for the children's message. And so if you have children or youth that are watching the video today, uh, that's great. If they're not watching, be sure and call them over at this time because I've got some things to share with them. Now, this video service is being uh, filmed for Palm Sunday. And so, guys, I want to talk with you a little bit about Palm Sunday. Now, just a couple of months ago, I led a mission team to the country of Sri Lanka in South Asia. It's over near India. And we went around to different villages. We were doing medical clinics and other things. And many of the villages we went to, the people came out in droves. They uh, welcomed us. We were often welcomed with garlands of flowers around our necks. In a couple of places, we even had a parade to lead us down into the village. And it was, it was very exciting. You know, everybody loves a parade. Um, when we have a Christmas parade, uh, we all get very excited. And what excites us most is the very last thing in the parade. What's the last thing of the Christmas parade? That's right, it's Santa Claus. <laughs> and everybody gets so excited uh, and cheers for Santa when he comes. Well, that was much like the scene in Jerusalem on that first Palm Sunday. King Jesus was coming into the city. People lined the streets, and some people walked in, in front of Him. Some people walked behind Him. Instead of a fire truck or a float, Jesus was riding on the back of a donkey. Now, I want us to practice doing what the people of Jerusalem did that day. As He rode through the streets of Jerusalem, some of the people waved palm branches. Anybody got a palm branch handy? Okay, if not, just use your hands and wave them back and forth. Here, I've got my palm branch. So they were waving palm branches, and then they would even throw them down on the ground in front. So you can wave your hands and pretend that you're flow, uh, throwing that palm branch down. And then the people that welcomed Jesus were, were shouting, Hosanna! Blessed is the one who comes in the name of the Lord. So let, let's say all that together. Let's shout it, in fact. Okay, we're going to say, Hosanna. Blessed is the one who comes in the name of the Lord. Okay, on three. One, two, three. Hosanna. Blessed is the one who comes in the name of the Lord. And they were welcoming Jesus. And then the other thing they did was some of the people took off their coats and threw them down on the roadway for Jesus to ride over. So I even brought my coat, this is my jacket, and so I'm just going to toss it down onto the street, right where Jesus would come, right over it. So you pretend to take your coat off and throw it down on the street. And that's how they welcomed Jesus on that Palm Sunday. Now today, we are celebrating Palm Sunday and we're celebrating the entry of Jesus, our King, into Jerusalem. It was the, a day that marked the beginning of an incredible week. And you'll hear more about it in the service. Let us pray together. Dear Lord, we just pray that you'll bless the children and youth of our church and community, all those that are watching the video today and their families, and help us to join our voices with the voices of the people in Jerusalem 2,000 years ago when they shouted, Hosanna, blessed is the one who comes in the name of the Lord as they welcome Jesus. May we welcome Jesus into our lives. In His name we pray. Amen. <music> 